Thanks for checking out the McGuire Chevrolet Cadillac Highlight of the Week. We support the community we serve. Visit us when you're ready for a newer pre-owned car. Maximize your fuel economy today with the Chevy Cruze. 592 miles between Phillips and 42 miles per gallon. This match starts at 106 pounds and watch Peter Lapari at Lenby Valley get the reversal as he goes on to a 4-0 decision over Christian Sylvan of Kittatinny and Lenby Valley has an early 3-0 lead. The move to 113 pounds and watch James Elphick get the 5-point move here for Kittatinny with the takedown and the back points. And then watch him work for the pin and he gets it in 255 over Magnum Villard of Lenby Valley and Kittatinny goes up 6-3. Waiting was real tough, like watching, because I like wrestling, but now that I'm finally back into the sport, it's, it's going good, smooth. At 120 pounds, watch Glenn Haynes of Lenby Valley get the escape over Dave Poppett as he holds on for the one nothing decision for the Pats, and this match is tied at 6. At 126 pounds, Matt Benvenuto of Lenby Valley is in complete control of this one as he gets the back points and registers the tech ball and 352, 20-4 over Kevin Jelinek, and it's 11-6 Lenby Valley. Now watch Tom Murphy of Kittatinny with the takedown here as he rolls to a 15-5 major over Dominic LaBelle of Lenby Valley, and Kittatinny cuts Lenby's lead to 1-11-10. We now move to 138 pounds, and it's Nick Romines of Kittatinny. He gets the points on the edge of the mat as he tops Joe LaBelle 9-1, and Kittatinny retakes the lead 14-11 after six matches. He uh, got me in a little scramble in the beginning and kind of caught me off guard, but I just tried to keep a cool head and, you know, wrestle and paid off. You know, I just kept working at it and I won night. I think it was like 9-1, so I just I can't get psyched that early about that stuff. But we moved to 145 pounds and it's Brandon Olson of Kittatinny with the reversal as he goes up 6-2 over Michael Naren of Lenape Valley. And then Olsen works for the fall later in the match and he gets it in 5 minutes and 7 seconds and the Cougars go up 20-11. Kittatinny received a forfeit at 152 pounds before Kieran Garrity of Kittatinny locks up the pin at 160 pounds and 141 over DJ Barrett and Kittatinny now leads 32-11 after nine matches. Okay, we go to 170 pounds and watch Jake Brook of Kittatinny get the reversal on Andrew LaBelle. They take a 2-0 lead early in this one. Then watch Andrew LaBelle get the escape here and we are knotted at two and we head to overtime. And in that overtime tied at two, Watch LaBelle get the escape, and he holds on for the 3-2 decision, and Lenby Valley trails 32-14 with four bouts left. At 182, Dylan Wonder of Kittatinny gets two here, as he posts a 7-3 decision over Christian Barrett, and the Cougars go up 35-14. Lenby Valley would forfeit at 195 and 220, before the Pats get a pin here and 257 at 285 pounds from Dante James, as he sticks Tommy Smith but Kittatinny will roll to the 47-20 win as Nick DiGennaro gets the post-match reaction. Even Christian, I think your kid uh, kind of beat us up. I think it was only 6-1, to one, but we closed the gap a little bit, and we looked competitive, and, and we, fr we actually frustrated their, their uh, great wrestler a little bit, so I was proud of Christian. Uh, James came out, you know, again, a little flip-flop, and we're, we're seeing how where his strengths and weaknesses are, and he just kept working, and all of a sudden, you know, he scored like 15 points, and then he came up with a pin. So, right for that, David Popic, it's like deja vu at Hunter Warren Sussex. We lost one nothing to uh, Haynes, and then we do it again today. Um, we looked better. I thought we looked a little bit better on the feet. It was just hard to score on, on uh, Mr. Haynes. So, it was, but I, I thought the kids did did really well. I mean, winners and losers alike. Uh, they worked really hard. Even a, a sophomore, Kevin Jelnick, getting uh, beat by. You know, Benvenuto and uh, you know, saved us a point. Instead of getting pinned, he fights off his back and gives up a tech fall. Now talk about it. You three guys, Garrett Armstrong, Jake Brook, yourself, all around the same weight, but having to cover those two heavier weight classes. Uh, well, we had to wrestle off each other just to find out, and they were going to pick me at 195 no matter if I won or lost my wrestle off. So I just have to go out there and do as best as I can whenever I can.